Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Israeli Air Force announced the establishment of Squadron 147, named RAM, at Pamakam Air Base. This new squadron is specifically dedicated to unmanned aircraft systems, UAVs, and it has been equipped with the Advanced Hermes 900 Kochav, Star, UAV to diversify and strengthen combat capabilities within the Army. Squadron RAM is tasked with critical missions, including conducting targeted airstrikes, intelligence operations, and surveillance across Israel's southern and northern borders, as well as the politically sensitive West Bank region. The inauguration ceremony received high praise from senior Air Force officials, including Major General Tomerbar, the Air Force commander, who described the current period as a time of war and praised the effectiveness of the UAV network. These drones have been crucial in eliminating Hamas targets and conducting intelligence operations. The Hermes 900 Kochav, Star, is a medium-sized, multi-sensor, medium-altitude long-endurance unmanned aerial vehicle designed by Elbit Systems, an Israeli defense company. As the successor to the Hermes 450, one of the most widely used military drones in the world, the Hermes 900 is equipped for tactical missions such as reconnaissance, surveillance, and communications relay. With an endurance of over 30 hours and the ability to fly at a maximum altitude of 30,000 feet, about 9,100 meters, this drone can operate over extensive areas for various intelligence missions. The Hermes 900 has a wingspan of 15 meters, 49 feet, and weighs 970 kilograms, 2,140 pounds, with a payload capacity of 300 kilograms, 660 pounds. Payload options include electro-optical-slash-infrared sensors, synthetic aperture radar with ground-moving target indication, as well as equipment for electronic and communications intelligence, electronic warfare, and hyperspectral sensors. In its operational history, the Hermes 900 was first used by Israel during Operation Protective Edge in July 2014. Although initially scheduled for operational deployment by the end of 2015, it was prematurely deployed for specific missions where it outperformed the Hermes 450. Shortly after receiving deployment orders, one Kochav was prepared for temporary activity. Its first operational mission occurred on July 15, 2014, during the Gaza War, where a series of operations and airstrikes destroyed Palestinian infrastructure. The drone returned to integration and flight testing after the operation to meet remaining milestones and was officially incorporated into the IAF's operational lineup on November 11, 2015. More recently, on April 6, 2024, a Hermes 900 was shot down by a surface-to-air missile fired by Hezbollah, highlighting the risks associated with its use in highly contested conflict zones. The addition of the STAR UAV to the arsenal of Squadron RAM represents a technological advancement for the Israeli Air Force and a strategic investment in the tactical flexibility of its aerial operations. This event also signifies a trend in the defense sector where the integration of unmanned systems into military arsenals is becoming increasingly common. That's all for now. See you later.